Hey guys, it's Izzy, and this is Ask Izzy, an awesome advice column for kids in need of some serious advice. So let's begin with today's questions. This first question is from Elisa, age 10. Dear Ask Izzy, I have a question and I understand if you won't answer it, but please try. I'm 10 years old and desperately want to move to Nashville to become a singer. How am I going to get anywhere in this tiny little town? How is anyone ever going to notice my talents? Dear Lisa, okay, look, I totally understand. I want to be a singer too, but you got to understand that you start out small and get bigger. You need to take any opportunity you have to sing in front of people too. So that way, once you do, then you're not scared. So try doing a lot of singing contests and talent shows, whatever you can. Now, it also help you stand out if you could write your own songs and learn how to play an instrument. Um, another thing that you can do to help you with your career is make a YouTube channel and post a bunch of videos of you singing original songs. That way, you'll really stand out. Now, once you're old enough to move out, then you ha will have a lot of practice. So, once you move to Nashville, you should start going around to different record companies and record labels and make a CD of you singing and pass them out there and eventually until one accepts you. Now, if, if you don't get any record deals, then another thing that you would do is record your own songs. So there's plenty of options out there, but you just can't give up. This next question is from No Name. Dear Ask Izzy, my friends are all going to do a seance at this abandoned barn across from Pine Box. They say a little boy who drowned in the river will, next to the barn will pull anyone who calls his name into the river and drown them too. Is this a true story? Dear No Name, look, your friends are totally just trying to scare you and I wouldn't want to go there and then just have them crank you and then You'd be like so scared and then just they'd just be like, I'm pranking. <laughs> anyway, look, even if it even if it was real, you would hear about it on the news and you'd probably hear it someplace other than what your friends are telling you. So even though it isn't real, I still wouldn't want to go because if if I were you, because you're still calling something out and you never know what could be out there. And if I were you, I wouldn't want to risk calling out spirits just to impress your friends. For this week's comment question, comment down below what you are going to be for Halloween. I'm going to be a huntress that has been shot in the head with arrows. Anyway, thanks for tuning in to Ask Izzy. Keep the questions coming and remember, anything goes. Just one rule, no adults. Until next week, if you have any problems, just keep asking Izzy. And don't forget to like my Twitter and Facebook page. See you guys next week. Happy Halloween.